Hey guys, myself Nitish Kaduria and I am here to display you about my project which I have created using a React app. Uh, I have created a to-do app where user can add a new task, uh, can update a particular task and delete the particular task as well or can mark it as a complete. So let's go and try to the demo of my project. This is the button which I have created for completing a particular task. Let's say this is the task which you want to complete. When we click on it, it says task complete successfully, right? If you want to delete the particular task, you can click on this delete icon and just delete it. It's a deleting data, task deleted successfully. Now that this task is no more. If you want to update, you can update it. Here the input, here in the input section, there is a task title or you can update it now. Okay, let's say I would this and I want to update it. Click on the save button. Hurry, the task updated successfully and you can see the task is also updated okay all the fetching logic i will tell you about how i am fetching from the api and how I'm updating just wait a minute let's try to add a new task let's i want to add a walking okay and let's try to add it yes walking is added successfully or you can now delete it complete it you can update it also let's try to update it Walking five. I say walking to walking five. Yeah, it's now updated. It's a walking five. Okay, great. So let's go to go through our code which I have developed, which I've written, and how I approach this problem. Okay. So this is our VS code. Uh, let's go to app.js file. Here I'm using the React notification component for rendering up all the notifications. Here is the to do container which is used for all uh, a container for the to do app. Okay, let's go for the component as a container, right? So, here I am using some files, update task handlers, and spinners, right? I will go through all that. I am using set up, setting up the state for set loading and the set to do means these are the states for setting up the to do's item which I am fetching from the API. It says it is in edit mode or not. Okay. Here are some functions which are used for completing the task, updating the task, and notifications. All are there for deleting a task and for add data. Here is a use effect which is used for fetching the data when the component is rendered. It is called and we are fetching the data. And this is our. Uh, we are using the add task and the show task. Add task is for the input form which you have seen where we add the task or the show task is the component we have which we are using the to rendering all the to-dos. Okay, so let's go through the show task. This is our comp show task component we are which, have, which I have using for showing rendering of all the tasks. Here it gets the probe as a to-do and ma we are mapping all over that. Okay, so let's go through the add task also. So this is the add task but form input. Here I am using the use ref hook for getting up the input values so let's go to the our api index to this. this is the file which i'm using for fetching logic or i say from for fetching updating and deleting all the cloud operations for to do that are from here this is the fetch to do function which i'm using for uh, fetching all the tools from the api ask uh, um add task handler this is the uh, handler function for adding a particular task again this is a dummy call delete a task again this is a dummy call and updating a task it is also a dummy call okay which i have written for updating a particular task. all the apis related uh, updates are in this api file all the components are in the components folder app.js contains only to do container and react notifications okay if you like my project then the then Please like it and comment it and share it. If you have any suggestion related to this app, you can put it in your comments. I will like to sh share you and updates. Okay. Thank you.